Hello everybody, Demon Werewolf here again, and this is actually going to be rather interesting because, well, let's just say that I had to re-record this one too! <laughs> Although in that time, I did learn a little trick if you didn't see there already. If you have no idea what I mean, you'll, you might get to see it in the races later. Um, where am I even trying to go? Oh yeah, to the pipes over here. Onward to Sewer Speedway! Why I'm trying to make that sound like an old haunted thing, I have no freaking clue. And I totally forgot to turn down the volume. Well, I can have it at 2. I think it's a uh, Digimon World 3 I have to have at 1 for. Trophy Race Speedway. Sewer Speedway. 3, 2, 1. Boost! I actually also tried something else in this game. I guess Uncle Uncle will have to tell us later, but I could have sworn in this game if you break on the green pads over there that they'll give you an extra speed boost. I could be totally 100% wrong and not even know it. Oh, I, want, I wanted that box. I wanted the box with the things and the goodies and the yums and the tools of destruction. Okay, I'm gonna try this here just to be safe. Well, it launched me pretty well, I'll say that much. And is one of the computers actually keeping up with me? And Oh man, no 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 that was not cool right there. That was not cool, Dingo Dial. We're supposed to be in the same speed range. Alright, um, in case I never did make it clear, I'm pretty sure I did at one point. You can throw the files forward, and I was about to, but other things got in the way. Speaking of which, I'm gonna get in your way. Dingo, Dingo, get back here, Dingo. Dingo, there you are, Dingo. Good die. Good die, mate. <laughs> All right. I think if you do leave the nitro under those little rolling barrows, and trust me, you will see more of those later on. It's not just a gimmick for this course. Um, if you leave anything like a nitro or a glass under it, it will break when it comes back around. I'm not 100% positive, I'm just pretty darn well sure. And let's clog up this nostril. Anybody gonna go for it? Mm -hmm. And jump and go. And right now, I gotta admit, I'm doing this... With my computer set up right now, I normally at least have a wireless mouse I put in with, with it to make it easier for me to control. I don't know if any of you guys ever got a chance to hear um, the little clicks it makes, but pretty much I can't find it, so I'm SOL right now, and I have to use this. Com I, I shit, just you know, I didn't want to become tiny, the tiny tiger. Oh, oh well. Oh, um, another thing we found out, and by we I do mean we, because I did record this way a, a while back, actually, is. When you have a bomb, you can use it to pick up a crate ahead of you, or that's off to the side. I'm not sure if you can use it to collect the CTR tokens or not, but you'll see that eventually. And what are these CTR tokens you're talking about? Well, you'll see in one of the next few races, I think. I actually kind of forget where I'm supposed to leave off at. <laughs> oh yeah, now I remember where we're supposed to leave off at. Anyways, we finally finished up the... Finally, it's been two bloody episodes, and we've actually seen this before, so goodbye. Ooh, I love this guy. While driving, yay! Last one's crossed the finish line, gets a rotten brain? Mmm, brains. Loading, loading, loading. Yeah, with the boss challenges, it's always all just a one-on-one -on -one race. In this case, it's with Ripperoo. Two, one, go! And he's he has powers that I envy. Granted, oh shoot. Horrible time to sum off, but there we go. I didn't even hit him! Oh man, this blows. No, 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 man. You can try and toss the TNT crate off your head, but the moment another one gets stuck onto you, it blows. Damn it. 
But yeah, he has infinitely respawning TNT, making it not only near impossible to hit the guy, but he litters the course with it, so it can actually be a bit difficult. So if you ever have trouble with a damn boss... Damn it! Urgh. He's kicking my arse! I swear he's programmed to send him out at certain points, though, because damn it! Damn this little ripper kangaroo in a fucking Well, I'd love to say he only puts him out at certain distances. That's not at all true. And I will say one thing that probably is true. Got him, finally! Is that I finally got the damn kangaroo? Oh, finally. Now just to keep you in my rear view mirror, you're not going to stay back there, are you? Come on. No, 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 you are not getting ahead of me, Ripper. Rip the Ripper will not get ahead! Actually, this is perfect. And the shield here, the green one will go away after some time, but the blue one will not. So, with that, I should be perfectly safe against any more of his tricks and shenanigans, and I am going to win. I win. Look at the time right there. Um, that's kind of, in my mind. I never really did check the time, but I think that proves that this is kind of a rubber band AI system with the bosses. Is they'll tail you real bloody hard as fast as they can, but the moment they're ahead of you, they'll only be off ahead by like four four seconds or something, so that it's possible for you to catch up. I know that's a lot normally in a race, but with games like these where you can stun a person for a good two seconds, it's not that hard. Good job, Tiny. <laughs> Why, thank you! I consider that an honor, Ripper. <laughs> In case you didn't notice, that, um, what he was wearing, yes, it was a straight jacket. And yeah, I like that character quite a bit. Hey, Unka Unka here, congratulate us. Congratulations on opening this new area. Here you will find four more tracks to race. Good luck. <laughs> Alright, now, if I remember right, what I did in the last episode, it was one one other course and that was it. You know why it was just this one other course? Because... Because... It took me three fucking tries! Skull Rock. Collect every crystal in the arena before the time runs out. If you get them all, you will win a prize. <laughs> And if you had a chance to look at the minimap there, you could see we were going everywhere. Uh, Skull Rock is not a race. It's not a battle zone, as much as I always like to think otherwise. It is simply collect all the crystals from the old Crash games and doing it in a certain amount of time. Uh, here is where turning would be the best, but Tiny sucks at that. He totally and utterly sucks. Okay, and the other thing is, there's one crystal out over by the coast, and I never remember which end it's on. Yeah, and it's kind of hard, admittedly, to get that one of all things. I overshot it! <laughs> I over freaking shot it. Lovely, Tiny. Lovely. Yeah, don't, obviously, learn from my mistakes, don't try to overjump that one at all. And yeah, I don't know if you got a chance to see, but when you're in water, the little cart actually spits out bubbles! Alright, um, now there's two that are a bit of a pain to get here, really. It's that crystal right there. And I don't think I remembered to go under. No, I didn't. I hope I didn't. Okay, it's right there. Easy win. I got it this time, so I guess CTR token awarded, okay. Alright, um, what I'm going to have to do instead, and this is going to make my count look off, but what I'm going to do this time I guess is a relic race or something like that. If you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, you might next episode. I know this is really stupid, but blame my setup, I guess. Um, I'm going to go over here to where I haven't done anything before, in the Mystery Caves. And we are going to do a CTR challenge. 
select the letters C, T, and R on each track and come in first place to win a CTR token. Beware, some letters are hard to find. <sighs> Admittedly, I don't know where the ones in the mystery cave are, but that's gonna be part of the fun is you're gonna have the experience right alongside me of trying to find them. And forgive me if I miss them on my first go around the course, but... Oh, I think I already remember where one of them are, actually. I didn't mean that one. I want to say there's one over here, but no, it looks just like a shortcut if you have a boost. Otherwise, it's a huge freaking waste of time like I just wasted there. Okay. Alright, where is it? Because I have no freaking clue. I literally have no idea where the other letters are. I mean, I'm keeping my eyes peeled as best I can. Aw, oh, man. Okay, there's the C, there's the R, where's the T? Where's the T? Where's the T? Find the beautiful T! You left your T in the mausoleum! Okay, really, where is this thing? I went around the whole course and I never saw it, that's not good! <laughs> oh man, I missed the R again. Where's the T? No, really, where's the T? must be over here, because that's the only other place I... Oh, okay, I'm lost. I have no fucking clue where this thing is. I literally have no fucking idea where this... Okay, I got the C finally. But I can't even find the T for the life of me. Where is the T? I mean, literally. I got no clue, people. And I found a glitch in the system, I think. Is it all the way over here? No, not that. Oh, it's right there! Oh, great. Oh, what the fuck?! Mid-air collision or something?! Oh my fucking god, that was cheap! That was fucking cheap! Okay, finally we got the R. All you need to do is get the T and finish in first. That's actually gonna be a bit of a tall order at this point, because I need to depend on anti-rubber band T AI or something like that. Alright. That wasn't good. I needed full boosting powers, and I'm only just getting shit items now. Okay, I just need to get ahead a little bit more, and fire! Okay, now I gotta remember, the T's on the far end. The T is on the far end. The T is on the far end here! No, 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 stay behind, stay behind, stay behind. Got it! CTR, I got the token. Oh my goodness, that was a challenge. I'm sorry I was a bit quiet there, I know, but again, I was searching so hard, trying so hard to get that in one freaking go. But I should still be trying to talk more for this, because admittedly, this is probably going to be a very short and very quick series. All right, um, do we have time? I, yeah, we do have time to do one of those, but I'd rather get one more CTR token, um, this one's gonna be over in the sewer one. Wrong way. I don't even know what I was trying to do right there. Okay, anyway, CTR challenge. I'm gonna be doing the relic challenges later, and by later I mean next episode. But for now, I don't want to do those just because I already did the Unka Unka thing and last time I did it too, and he's gonna re-explain all that now for you guys. Three, two, one, go! Oh, okay, that was a bad start. Or in this case, a bad finish. Okay, this is one of the ones where it's harder to find where the CTR is because you have two pathways. Okay, there's the T, I saw it up there. And even here, it's like, I'm trying more to keep on the top side to... Okay, there's the R. I don't care if you hit me, because you're going to hit me right into... Okay, almost right into the R. Almost right into the R. Okay. Okay, no tiny tiger. Um, Alright, there's the C then. 
and got the C. Okay, all I need to do is get the T and I'm switched. And yeah, as I just showed, you can prematurely um, blow up the bombs to try and catch people in the blast radius. And yes, it does work. I've actually been comboed off a bomb explosion. I've been comboed off of one of those, where a point of another racer or two will be able to get ahead of me thanks to it. Okay, just need to switch there. Take the lower path, and I got the CTR, just need to win the race now. Tiny squish puny cars. Tiny wishes he could squish puny cars, but Tiny's aiming sucks. Or rather, mine does. Okay, just need a little bit more boost, a little bit. Not what I was going for. Not anywhere near what I was going for. Okay, that should cement me in first place for a long time. Shut up, Crash. Okay, but anyways, admittedly, they could have been a lot more jerkish with the placement of the CTR on this one, because really only one of the letters is in a different... I shouldn't say different, um, in one of the split paths here, so they could have been a lot worse with it. Because there's at least three different split paths I can think of off the top of my head, and with this here, um, most of the time it's real easy to take a look up here and see what you're gonna miss or what you're gonna take. And I think I just might barely, no I'm not, oh I just barely, okay, there we go. And if you want to go ahead guys, go ahead, I dare you, go ahead and go on. See how smart of an idea it is. Okay, just barely got through. And um, for those of you who are wondering, the way you turbo is you jump with one of your two shoulder buttons, either L or R, and then use the opposite button to activate it. And jump, and fire the missile for the hell of it, and win. There we go. Okay, I'm probably going to call that the episode now. CTR token awarded, and if I remember right, you don't have to go through all the first, second, third for this junk for the CTR. Yeah, I wasn't even paying attention for what we were doing before. I really think it's just for the trophies. Yep, it is. Okay, so, for the last thing I'm going to do in this episode, honestly, I hate how much my TV has been flashing. So, I'm going to take my Rage on TV. Die! Uka Uka, get out of the screen. I will actually shut you up. I will shut you up. Now then, as I was saying, DIE TV! Yep, this is how we save. Uh, the name's A, just because, yeah, again, I had to redo it, so, as you see, over here. But we only have 2% done in this episode, we're gonna, we have a little bit more done before. In the next episode, we will get the CTR tokens of a few more courses, even get a few relics. I'll see you guys next week for Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Racing. Have a nice night, and just enjoy yourselves. Bye.